Yo, what's up, guys? Gonna do a video on uh, just some dungeon strolls. We got in some. Oh, actually, I got some stuff to sell. Forgot about. All right. So I'll go in with some stuff. All right. Let's do this, guys. Go win solos, high rollers, two forks, one outlet. Let's do it. So I'm doing a base 48 to the head. 45 on the first wing, 48 on the second, 50 on the third, 52 on the fourth. Damn, look at the speed on the short sword. I know a lot of people seem to uh, disregard the short sword, but if you look at the speed on it, especially when you have high dexterity, dude, like this thing slaps. Look, let's compare them. Instant, like one, two, three. This is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one. So you could even like go up to someone, you could one, two, and then hang on, one, two, step back and smack them twice with this, and you could pretty much kill people. Go damn. Right, let's get into it, eh? Right, like this room. Mate, right, that skeleton had no chance, mate. Oh no, is it a Barnaby? No, it's a uh, Zweihander. So with these Y-hander guys, you want to walk directly into them, crouch and look at the ground. That way you're going to block their hits. And that's with anyone really. Even with people that use Y-handers. Because generally most of the people are using it for high swings. Not many people use it for a low swing. Generally that's how you're going to get away with dodging them type of swings. Do it again with this guy. Just like that. Probably should go down there. A little different with these guys. You generally want to try and not trigger their gas. Guy almost dead. If you keep walking back in a in a timely manner, you generally won't trigger the gas. Usually with mummies, I'll let them attack each other, but. Gotta get going. Got me mummies down here. Alright. Someone's in here. What the fuck? Fair enough. I don't think anyone's in these things. Nah. No! <laughs> Easy, Kotika. Push up on this way. Maybe there's an escape out here. But there there is. Easy run. Let's see how much we made from that. 144, 7 monster. Oh, I did do it. I had to kill one Wraith and two more Skeleton Rages. Rages, Rages, nice. Alright hey guys, that's going to be the uh, end of the first one. Appreciate you guys tuning in. You guys should definitely get this game. It's called Dark and Darker. Uh, it's coming to Steam sometime this year. Uh, could be in the next three months. Don't know, not sure. Uh, you can buy it on darkanddarker.com for 35 USD. Or you can get the Hold Line Edition for 50 USD. Hold Line Edition gives you... Access to the test servers where you can test all the new stuff. For example, on the test seat servers, they have a uh, the Druid class you can test. It's pretty broken. Um, I might do a video on that another time. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, and catch you guys around.